Hello everyone and welcome back. Today I am going to share with you how to make two hot chocolate drinks. And I'm going to show it two different ways. One is using a commercially available chocolate sauce. I'm using a Da Vinci chocolate sauce. And the other is using powder. I'm using my own blend of dark chocolate powder, which is unsweetened. For this, I'm going to use eight ounces and I'm going to use the espresso machine. If you do not have a machine, by all means, you can use the same procedure. You can just mix everything, put the cup in a microwave, and that should do the trick. Or if you want to use a saucepan, if you do not have a microwave, you can also use the same procedure again and put everything in a saucepan to warm the milk and the chocolate. The recipe using the sauce, there are only two ingredients. One is the chocolate sauce and the other is fresh milk. So only two ingredients because the sauce is sweet enough. For the one that's using the dark chocolate powder, we are going to make use of the fresh milk and also an ounce of my milk syrup. For those of you that do not know yet what is a milk syrup, please check the link above, okay? This is my own version of half and half, concentrated half and half. So we're going to start by making the one which uses chocolate sauce. For this, I am going to use 30 ml or one ounce of the chocolate sauce. This pump is 10 ml. So I'm going to give it two pumps, one, two. And then we're going to fill the steaming pitcher up to the bottom of the spout right here with fresh milk. Okay, and then we are going to use the steamer. For the next one, the one that's using the powder, it's very, very simple. All we have to do is use, again, use the steaming pitcher. And what I'm going to do is to put one scoop or one tablespoon, only one tablespoon, because this is an eight ounce cup. So one tablespoon of my dark chocolate powder, unsweetened dark chocolate powder. Make sure you always keep the bag sealed. And then I am going to put my sweetener here. This is absolutely optional. I'm going to use just one ounce of my milk syrup into the steaming pitcher and then fill it up to the bottom of the spout with fresh milk. Because this is chocolate, really most people who would love to drink their chocolate would love to make it a little bit sweeter. Always wipe the steaming one before you start to use it. Okay, and also purge so there is no water in the one. Okay, and then steam. There you have it, two different hot chocolate drinks using two different types of ingredients. Now, you can add some like marshmallows on top or some chocolate shavings here to make it more chocolatey. Or sprinkle with chocolate powder. Now, in terms of color, seems like the one that we use the chocolate sauce is darker than the one that we use the chocolate powder. Now, let's give this a try. This is the one with the chocolate powder. Mm. Wow, that is hot. Delicious.
try the other one. Mm. A bit on the sweet side, but for the, the one that I used, the dark chocolate powder with 30 ml of milk syrup, it is not bad. It is just perfectly sweet. But both equally delicious. There you have it, very, very simple recipes that you can make at home using either a machine or you can use the microwave to warm your chocolate drink. So whichever is more accessible for you, use that ingredient. That's all I want to share with you today. I hope that you learned something new. I'll see you again in my next video tutorial. In the meantime, stay safe. Thank you for watching. Ciao for now.